Mm. It's computer love. Computer love. Hey, family. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to you. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. Uh, I want to give out a little information for y'all just to be on the beware. It's on the up and up. That is, um, and I don't know if you guys have already experienced it or if it's harmed your computer, but there's a fake Windows update. And they are reportedly being circulated to spread a mag, uh, a ransomware and steal the user's data, especially students and other non-professional users' data. Bleeping Computer has shared that they have received a surge of requests for help regarding this ransom infection. I hope I don't got it. Uh, targeting users across the world. It initially appears to be a, a Windows 10 cumulative or security update. As per the virus total, this appears to have started on April 8th, 2022, and has seen targeting a large number of users worldwide since then. While it's not 100% clear how the fake Windows 10 updates are being circulated, these are distributed under various names like Win 10.0, underscore system underscore upgrade underscore software dot msi and security underscore upgrade underscore software underscore win 10 uh dot zero dot msi these downloads are distributed through fake wearers and crack sites so what happens is upon downloading these fake Windows 10 updates, the ransomware deletes shadow volume copies and then encrypts the files. It produces a readme type of document in each of the folders in which it encrypts. The documents then redirect the users to the um, Magnabur's payment page, which is called My De Deceptor. Um... The website then provides users with one free file, which it decrypts without charge, then allows the victim to find out cryptocurrency, which cryptocurrency address they would uh, send the ransom. It also provides options to contact its support team for help. The ransomware demands range of about 2500 or 0 0.068 bitcoins as for now there are no known ways of deciphering files that are encrypted by the magnabur ransom strain this is not the first time that the fake software has been targeting regular users so there were earlier also antivirus software updates to flash player updates that have been constantly popular um, and it's duping the users into downloading ma malware, and it's been doing that for years. Recently, cybersecurity researchers from Malware Hunter team detected the SMS phishing campaign where Android users receive a text message asking the user to complete an update to the Flash player or else lose the video upload they uh, started couldn't be done, or else the video they started couldn't be done. The same MS, SMS message contains a link that directs the users and Android banking trojan flubot malware, and it steals login information by overlaying many global banks. Follow HT Tech um, for the latest news and reviews. That is insane. So, you know, they got us all into these computers, and now we're in a uh, vulnerable situation where People can just hack us. Uh, first, it was all funny games. Shit ain't funny no more. When people can go in there and take your information, take your money, uh, all types of craziness, which I have been a victim of, like I said before. So I'm just uh, telling y'all to beware, okay? 
and it's a Windows 10 download. These features will not make it to. Um, so I'm just saying, hey, probably got to get up out of it and just put 11 on your computer and be done with it. If it's not on there. All right, you guys. Tell me what you think about that or had you heard about it already? All right, I'll see you in the next video.